This review is of Right Foods, Dr. McDougall's Vegan Ramen Chicken Flavor with Organic Ramen Certified by QAI. It is also non-GMO. Um, and um, surprisingly, it's vegan, but also no source, no BPA, sustainable forestry initiative certified sourcing. Um, I don't really see anything else here. I was kind of hoping for a kosher or a parv or a halal or something like that or anything else. Here are the cooking instructions, nutrition facts, and the ingredients and stuff. And uh, 180 calories per cup, one gram of fat, which is unsaturated, no cholesterol, 680 milligrams of sodium, 34 grams of carbs, of which three are dietary fiber, so it could be better. 2 grams of sugar, of which one is added, and 8 grams of protein. All right, hold on while I get this ready to eat. Thanks for, thanks, hold on. Okay, so let's give McDougal's a try. Um, McDougal's only came with the noodles and a package that contained dehydrated vegetables, such as, um, looks like carrots and, and um, corn. And uh, spices in it. Where, um, yep, that's all I'm really seeing here. Some of these corn kernels look horrible. So, let's start with the flavor of the broth. You know, there's a huge amount of sugar, uh, salt that's in here, I mean. And the um, corn kernels are okay, but for the amount of um, oh my god, not all the images got that. There's a bump over here, but it's still works. Oh wow. Well. The amount of salt that's in here is pretty bland. There's a bit of sweetness, oddly enough. But ultimately, um, it is. Fairly bland soup. You know, granted, I did let it steep longer than the um, recommended um, five minutes, but um, that may uh, explain why the flavor is kind of off. Um, yeah, I'll give this uh give this a thanks for watching and I hope you have a great day.